Hi planner friends, it's Nia. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing my March 2020 month at a glance in the Erin Condren Daily Petite Planner. And um, I was going back and forth on what kit I wanted to use, what washi and stickers I wanted to use. Um, and ultimately I decided to go ahead and go with this Grace's Plans kit for March. Not my favorite. Um, just as far as I really like Grace's plans. The what's not my favorite is the um the print, the picture, what it is, but I'm gonna roll with it. I also have this one from um Dolce and Dahlia on Etsy that's a printable, and I just don't want to go with the color scheme, but I am gonna pull some things from this kit to use. And then I have some stickers from um Hobby Lobby, these are paper studio. Um, the, I believe this is the LOL. I also have already laid down most of the numbers because it takes forever. And, um, if you've seen a few of my videos recently, you know, I have my rant about, um, the coffee spilling in my bag. So this bottom portion of my planner is watermarked because of that. Um, they also, for Erin Condren, do... Um, the calendar where it starts to go into the next month. And so um, in February, the kit that I used, um, I added some washi in uh, at the end of the month and at the beginning of the month to cover that up. And this was a Grace's Plans kit as well. So this month, um, March starts on a Sunday, so there's nothing at the beginning of the month, but there's like a week and a half down here at the end of the month that I want to cover up. So I made some washi strips on my own printer, and I'm going to be putting those on there. And they, it actually, the color I plan to use matches really well, but then my printer, I changed the ink, and I'm still getting yellow for whatever reason. It doesn't like the blue ink, and I got tired of playing with it, so... I'm going to have to come back and work on that later. Anyway, that was a whole bunch of extra information that you probably didn't need. So that's what I'm doing today. I'm going to start with this um, header here for the top. And there are some numbers that I did not put on here because um, either it's a holiday or I have something going on that day and I want to put a box down before I do that. And then I will put the number on top of the box. So March is, um, for the most part, I think will be a pretty quiet month. I don't have a whole lot of things going on, at least not planned right now. Um, there is, of course, um, time changes. I'm in California, so we spring forward. Um, it, the first day of spring is coming and, um, St. Patrick's day. So there's some things that definitely will be taking place. So I'm going to, this is one of the, the washi strips and it should be, it should fit here across the bottom. I'm also going to, um, put down some simply gilded washi to make it a little bit more decorative and things don't stick the greatest down here since it was wet and so we are just living with that reality and so this is of course lighter because the ink it just sort of had a mind of its own but I figure uh, with the washi I plan to put down and it's too short. With the washi I plan to put down, it should be fine. So that's that. And I have a few other strips if, if I need to use them. So my goal is to print another one to put here. Or maybe I'll just put some washi there. I don't know. But I, I, I want to cover it up. I don't like having the next month in my month at a glance. I like my month at a glance to just be the month that I'm in. And this is a little short here, but I am going to... Um, I'll just put a doll sticker or something there and take care of that that way. So this strip um, is included in the kit to go down the side. And um, let's 
see. Actually, I think, so let me open these stickers up. Actually, I think what I'll do is, okay, my brain is going faster than my mouth. Um, <laughs> let my words catch up to where my brain is at. I think what I will do is take these um, strips that come with the kit and use those along the bottom. And that will take care of that. And again, um, sticking on here is not the best because it was wet and it's sort of crinkled and does not want to cooperate anymore. Okay, so got that side and we're gonna add a strip to the other side. All right, so we've got those in there, and I'm going to add this sticker here, which sort of fills in that gap for me and covers up the number four. So that makes me happy. Um, okay, I'm going to come back to these stickers. I do have a let's do one thing at a time. Okay, so the 8th is spring. First day of spring. Or actually, no. I'm sorry. The 8th is the day that time changes. And um, I don't know I don't think I have a time change sticker. I already put down the 19th. So I'm going to pull that up. That is the first day of spring. Because I want to put this sticker here. Which says the best part of winter is when it's over. I am not a fan of winter. I am a summer baby all day long. Then I have an event on the 17th and 18th, and the 17th is St. Patrick's Day. So, um, I want to, okay, I'm going to use a couple of the other little squares here. I don't have two of the same, so I wish I had another green. I'm going to use this yellow. And then I will put the 17th and 18th. And the reason I put the numbers down ahead of time is because it takes me forever. Like, I just did these two really quick. Um, but I use tweezers and it just takes me a little bit of time to get it right. And that drives me nuts. Okay, so... The 8th. So I'm going to put the St. Patrick's Day sticker down. This is another Paper Studio sticker. It's entirely too long, but that's fine. That is not something that bothers me. The dates 
into the next month or something that bothers me. So we've got that. I need to still do this um, spring forward. So I actually, I think if I do put a sticker there, it'll be fine to either white it out or to use like a half box to cover that up. So I'm just going to go ahead and put the eight down so it's there. Um, let's get into, we have on the ninth full moon and on the 24th new moon. And I do like to track the moon. I especially like to know when it's a full moon because it explains a lot when people act odd. Um, it's like, oh, it's a full moon. Got it. And I can go about my day. Um, for me, I am a government employee and we have Cesar Chavez off, which is the 31st. So I'm off that day. And then I took off the 30th, that will be a wonderful four-day weekend. So we'll put those down. A little bit bigger than I'd like, but it's okay. These are from Lexington Flare. And they're just little day-off squares. And then um, on the 30th as well, it is payday, so... See if I have a payday flag. And it's also gonna be bigger than I'd prefer, but that's okay. Okay, I was just looking at it. Where did it go? I've got a ton of these are I'm off camera, but these are my Lexington flare stickers. Okay, I don't know what just happened to the day off. Oh, not day off, payday. Okay, so payday is the 30th. So we'll put that on there. And then recycle is the fourth and the 18th so we will add that I'm gonna actually put it over here because I am gonna be filling in on the 18th okay so I had wanted to add in some washi but I think that would be overkill. So I am not going to add in washi. I do want to use some additional stickers I want to cover up. These numbers. So I'm just going to wipe them out. That alone just made my blood pressure go down. Um, so I think um, I will put uh, some stickers on top of this thicker washi down here at the bottom. And
just looking in a couple of the Erin Condren sticker books to see if there's anything I can pull out of there. So for this one, I'm going to use this four leaf clover, or maybe that's a three leaf clover. There's more than one, so I'm going to use both of these. Okay. Alright, so we've got Payday, Days Off, St. Patrick's Day, I've got an event, I've got my recycle down. Full Moon, New Moon, St. Patrick's Day, I'm going to figure out what I want to put here for spring, first day of winter, or first day of winter, first day of spring. Um, so that's it for this month. Um, just very simple and easy. So that is my March 2020 month at a glance. Hopefully this video inspired you. The kit again is from Grace's Plans on Etsy. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.